Welcome everyone to a brand new season of NBA basketball. I'm sure you're as excited as all of us are here at 2K Sports as we get ready to start the season in style. I'm Kevin Harlan. We've got Steve Smith and Greg Anthony alongside and our sideline reporter tonight, David Aldridge. Hey Dave. Thank you, Kevin. Russell Westbrook has passed the great Oscar Robertson for first overall in career triple doubles. Westbrook says, I just do what you need to do in order to win. My job is to do everything. That's what I do night in and night out, and nobody else does it the same. Simple as that. Kevin, nobody calls a game like you. <laughs> David, you are too nice. Thank you so much. And Westbrook, he is incredible. Thank you, David. And here's what the schedule for the Lakers looks like. On Tuesday, they'll take on Stephen Curry and the Golden State Warriors. And then on Friday, they'll go up against Devin Booker and the Phoenix Suns. Here are the starters for Los Angeles. And they have their big three all out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at the forward. Marcus Saul is out there with Monk and for Dallas. The guard pair, it's Doncic and Hardaway. Finney Smith in at the forward with Porzingis as the other. And it's Powell in at the five, rolling the paint. And Greg, with over a decade you had in the NBA, is there an opening night that you remember most? Man, that very first time putting on that Knicks jersey. The game was in Orlando. I played 28 minutes, which was a lot for a rookie back then. And I'll never forget that night. Even though he missed it, this is the exact play your offense is designed to produce. Monk kicks to Gasol. Pass to James. Good, and the assist goes to Gasol. James has got the scoreboard going with his first points of the night for the Lakers. Outside Hardaway. Doncic against Westbrook. Powell with a screen on Westbrook. Here's Doncic. Powell trying to free himself up. And Doncic gets it to go. And that's the way to close. Once Doncic has this type of look, game over. And Kevin, everybody's dissected Luka's offensive game, trying to find that weakness. And I'm just here to tell you, I don't think he has it. Now here's Westbrook. Gasol a screen on Doncic. Four on the shot clock. Or three, Westbrook. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Outside Hardaway. Doncic right side over Westbrook. That's good from Doncic on the assist from Hardaway. Doncic has got his second basket of the night. And the play of Doncic drawing comparisons to so many all-time greats. But Greg, the one that stood out to me, they said he's a combination of Larry Bird and Magic Johnson. What do you think? And it just makes sense with his passing and shooting. You throw in the step-back game of James Harden, you start to see why he has become such a problem for this league. Looking at who's out there now for the Mavericks. Maxi Kleba, he's checked in for Dwight Powell. And it's Jalen Brunson in for Dorian Finney-Smith. Now here is Davis. It's hauled in by Persingas. Pass to Doncic. Shoots over Bazemore. That one off the back iron and out. For Los Angeles, they've gone one of three for the field to start this one so far. Westbrook passes to Bazemore. Trains it from beyond the arc. Bazemore has developed into a reliable long-range shooter, especially from the corners. Westbrook against Brunson. No one near Doncic as he lets it fly. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. And he's having quite the quarter, converting at a really high percentage. To the inside. And Westbrook gets Russell it to go. Westbrook. Great pass. We talk about 80s guard-like skills. That includes his floor vision. Doncic outside. Here's the triple. That doesn't go either for Doncic. You know what, though? Sometimes you can be too open. I think it may have surprised him, and that's why he missed. Hazemore finds Davis. 15 seconds left in the first quarter. 
Kicks it out to James. And he drives in. And that one, good. LeBron's got his second basket of the game. The tremendous strength of LeBron on display going right through the contact. So at the end of one quarter of play, still a close game. Lakers ahead, leading by just two. After this break, we'll be back with the start of the second quarter on 2K Sports. Russell Westbrook say his job is to do everything, but he understands that it's also a team effort. We got to do it together, and uh, I think that's more important than scoring any points or doing anything else is, is leadership, and uh, that's where I got to find my, my niche and uh, try to lead the guys. A great leadership, an area where Westbrook, I think, feels he's growing. And with his motor, he's always been a culture setter. But bringing your teammates along is also about setting the tone for collaboration. And we hope you're enjoying the game. Both teams tonight keeping things pretty even so far in the scoreboard. And from what we've seen so far from the Lakers, guys, what are your thoughts? Hey, why take jump shots when you can get your points at the rim? Especially at the start, you want to get something positive going and establish your rhythm. They've got Reggie Bullock, Brown out there with Maxi Kleba. Then there's Brown, and it's Brunson in at the point. That's the lineup out there for the Mavericks. Mavericks making a switch here. Finney Smith's checked in. The Mavericks trailer. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. Christoph Porzingis is returning to form after his knee surgery. He says making sure it's strong and stable is nonstop work. I'm feeling better, and I have confidence that I can go out there and play freely. His offense has been great. It's the defensive end that he's still getting right. Guys? Well, we know he can be a presence DA, and I think eventually he's going to be what he wants to be. Thank you. Rondo against Brunson. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. And it's blocked by Brown. Inside. Brown the pass to Brunson. Good D by Ariza. So for Dallas, their last game a loss to the Bucks. None kicks to Rondo. One thirty-five left now here in the second. Here's Howard. And it's good coming on the assist by Rajon Rondo. Howard's got his first basket of the night. Well, Steve, back in 2002, you led the NBA in three-point shooting at over 47% a game. How would you have liked playing today? I would have loved it, Kevin. The reason why, I could have shot more threes. And with more threes, gives you more stats. And with more stats, gives you the bag. Timeout call for the Lakers. The Lakers. Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. Our Mavericks will go for a different look here. Cauley Stein, he's checked in for Moses Brown. Porzingis comes in for Brown. Tim Hardaway Jr. is checked in for Reggie Bullock. And Doncic is subbed in for Jalen Brunson. And here is Los Angeles now. They trail by one. Westbrook surveying the D. Over Doncic. Westbrook, no good. The Mavericks have gone two or three from the field here to open the second quarter. Doncic finds Porzingis. Doncic with it. Down low. Here's Hardaway. Rejected by Gasol. 
Gasol with those long arms is a shot blocking expert, especially down low. James with the bucket. And we'll see if they can finally hold on to a lead. It's been back and forth all night. Both teams putting forth their best efforts right now. This is the kind of game fans pay to see. Now here is Hardaway. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Screen by Porzingis. Just two to shoot. Hardaway, no good. Now Monk to the paint. Davis dishes to Westbrook. This one for three. No good there. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Lakers lead by two. The Lakers are chest out and send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much here with Frank Vogel. Coach, the point's coming with regularity in that first half. What's been the key? We're playing with a high offensive motor. We're screening through physicality. We're cutting hard. We're moving the basketball. We're getting good shots for ourselves. And it's showing on the floor, Coach. Thanks for your time. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. And we'll be back after halftime as the third quarter gets underway. Hey, folks, first off, let's take a look at the overall NBA schedule on tap for tonight. The Brooklyn Nets will go up against the Bucks out in Milwaukee. 7.30 p.m. Eastern time is the tip-off. Marquee matchup is going to be a wild one. Now looking at that first half of play, Lakers find themselves in a battle. I have to applaud their offensive consistency. They're not wasting possessions or taking bad shots. That's a testament to their patience, their discipline. They're focusing on playing intelligent basketball. And that'll do it for our halftime show. Let's get you back out to the game. Where's Crafty? Where's my mac and cheese? Right there with you, brother. I need my kale salad, though. Kale salad. Mac and cheese. Veritable twins. I'm opting for the uh, blue cheese lasagna. Ooh, what is that? And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, the second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams try to gain an edge. Look at LeBron James. He's really been playing well. Yeah, and just look at the numbers from the first half. He has been very efficient. And it's not like everything's been at the rim. There's been a number of jump shots along the way. And we've got second half action for you. Thus far, a pretty evenly contested game. The Lakers in the lead. Taking a look at Los Angeles. And they have their big three all out there. Westbrook at the point with LeBron and Davis at the forward. LeBron, Elite yeah. bunk out there with Marc Gasol. The indestructible one. LeBron brushing off contact with an easy deuce. And this is year one of LeBron's two-year $85 million extension. And, Greg, that will take him through age 38. And that will amount to $435 million in career earnings, the most all-time. And it wouldn't surprise me if he's got a few more years left in the tank after that. And the rebound battle split evenly thus far. Monk, the pass to James. And the layup's good off the glass. Now it's a six-point Laker lead. Inside, James can really carve the defense apart. His strength makes him such a tough cover. Roger outside. A minute 50 left in the third quarter of the game. The three. Anthony Davis with the rebound. And it's Davis with the ball for the Los Angeles Lakers. They haven't given up any points here in the second half. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions. Right now, they need the basket. Doncic with it. Westbrook picks him up. Here's Persingas. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. And what a motor. Porzingis is an all-star talent who is also willing to do the dirty work. It's time for 
Ladies and gentlemen, your Maverick Dance Team. for the Mavericks. And let's check out the stats for Rondo. Some last season stats for him. He averaged about five points per, four assists, and two rebounds. Backup point guard, always an important position, and he fills that role beautifully. Without a good floor conductor coming off the bench, your offense can quickly grow stagnant. He solves that problem well. One sixteen left in the third quarter. Lakers working the ball around now. Now, here's none. He's guarded by Bullock. Here's Anthony. Oh, and a jam by Anthony. Anthony. Sky high. One of his advantages as a undersized four. Average trail by six. Brown right side. Back to Brunson. Howard trying to free himself up. The shot's good from Brunson. Brunson's got five points so far. That's the kind of aggressive and assertive play they need as we get closer and closer to crunch time. There's the drive. None can't get it to fall. Dallas has gone 0-2 from deep to start things here in the second half. Brunson the pass to Bullock. Rondo against Brunson. Brown outside. The dish to Bullock. Pocket six. Over Anthony. And it's Bullock missing. Can't fault the play call. Even though he couldn't convert, that's a good shot. Out of bounds. It'll be Maverick's ball. Coming down to the floor for the Lakers. Trevor Ariza. Right around three minutes into the second half. And we've reached the end of the third. Los Angeles on top. They're up by four. And we'll get going after this from the American Airlines Center. And while we can now, let's take a look at today's State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to prevent that basket. Brady plays for others. It's an art form, but it's also a discipline. Fantastic job. Come on, man. And I know I speak for all of us when I say I can't wait to see what kind of finish awaits us here in the fourth quarter. The guard pair, it's Doncic and Hardaway. And the post players for him, Kleba and Porzingis. And it's Bullock in at the three, the small forward. That's the lineup in the game for Dallas. Now, here's Bullock. Westbrook pulls it in. Trying to take advantage of soft defense. He might have gotten over eager. Monk finds Davis. What an emphatic slam by AD. He put all of his power to work on that one. Doncic against Westbrook. Looking to get back on track here. And Davis sends it back. Here's LeBron. It's rebounded by Doncic. And so Doncic will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. Six-point game. About a minute played here in the fourth quarter. Two minutes remaining in the game. 
Yeah. And that one clearly a foul. Well, Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. That one on Davis. That's his well, what determination foul. from Doncic pushing his shot through despite that some stiff defense to draw the foul. Luka. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for Los Angeles. What tremendous passing we've seen from them today. A very unselfish performance all around. Yeah, but also give them credit for the layups they've had tonight after strong drives to the basket. Good on the first, and that brings them within five. A, a generational talent. Doncic able to carry a team and make others around him better. Cauley Stein, he's checked in for Dallas. Dorian Finney-Smith comes in for Reggie Bullock. Free throws good from Doncic. Guys, that was critical. I mean, that's what we're used to seeing out of him, though, at moments like this. Westbrook passes to Gasol. Davis kicks to James. Shot clock at six. It's not going to go for him. Now the Mavericks take it the other way. Hardaway dishes to Doncic. A pass to Porzingis and stolen by LeBron. Shoots from the line. Porzingis with the rebound. Porzingis has got his fourth rebound in this one. Dallas moving it around. Doncic looking it over. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Well, that's a high percentage look when the D doesn't fight over the screen. Reason why it takes extra energy to do it. You have to trust your defensive rotations, but it's worth it. The Mavericks are gone. One of three from the field to start the fourth quarter. The feed to call is done. Yes! That is world class. Incredible shot with everything on the line coming through for his team. White Powell's checked in for Paulie Stunt. Now let's go to the sideline and catch up with our Hall of Famer, David Oldham. Well, thanks, guys. I was able to hear Frank Vogel talk to his team during the break. This game is close, and he told his players, hey, guys, this is when it's fun, right? This is a close game, and this is when you get to show what you're made of. Right here, right now. Kevin, we'll see how they respond. Thanks, David. Here's James, guarded close. It's him! And he the gives him the lead with that basket there. That's his trademark, that folks. It's exploding to get to the rim. Here's Hardaway. And here's Perzingis for a three. Connects from downtown. And when you rank stretch bigs, you have to place Porzingis toward the top of that list. This guy is a pure shooter at 7-3. 
they'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see longer possessions from this point on. They had a foul to give there, but you'd rather not have it cost your team. At the line for Dallas, Tim Hardaway Jr. Taking two shots. It's the first, and that will put them up by two. And so he drops them both. It's a three-point game. That's why you want him at the line when the game is close. He knows how to deliver in the clutch. Who wants a t-shirt? Make some noise! All right, look who's come on to the court. Come on and get loud for your Mavericks dance team. Twenty-four seconds left in the game. Westbrook against Doncic. The best rebounding point in the association. Westbrook hitting the offensive glass with a purpose. There's 14 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And they need to stop the clock, so there's a foul. And okay, you know what? Smart foul. You gotta try and extend the game. At the line for Dallas. Dwight Powell. Two shots. And that hurts as he doesn't get the first one to fall. Trying to focus now on the second. The second of two is good. That will put them up by two. We've got 13 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Monk. Gasol's screen. Bullseye! And Monk has proven that he is a terrific scorer from the perimeter. When he's in rhythm, he has no problem letting it fly. It's a T-shirt Ladies and gentlemen, your Mavericks dance team. Porzingis for a three. Oh, the all or nothing shot. No good. That so it's Los game. Angeles taking the W in a close one. They break the hearts of every fan in the building with a dramatic late victory. And Kevin, this is the kind of win you have to take a ton of pride in. I mean, they battled with everything they had and came through when the pressure was at its highest.
And now we'll send it over to David Aldridge, who is standing by courtside. David. Thanks very much. LeBron, when you know AD is behind you, how does that help you defensively? You can stay home. You can allow him to play one-on-one -on -one versus a guard versus a big, and you can stay home and be able to box out and get rebounds because he's that good. It's quite a one-two punch, man. Congrats on the win. Back to you. David, thank you as always. That concludes the first game of the NBA season. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching as New Balance presents our player of the game, LeBron James.